once again, Juan Hernandez here from Dominican Republic, my channel, Body's Ideas. Like always, trying to get an idea through to the drone community to help save money and have uh, nice flying, nice footage and everything. Uh, a couple of videos ago, I made a video about a gimbal that I made and a friend asked me, a couple of subscribers asked me if I could show them how I did it. I, I almost didn't do it because it's not a really big thing. It's, and it's really ugly and you know, it's a prototype. I am gonna make a better one. So, but I can't say no to someone that you know, wants to see how things are done. Actually, this is the gimbal. See, so what it is is I put, let me show you guys from the beginning. I made a few little holes here. After I put the legs on the drone, I put a few little holes here. The first one was too low, so then I, uh, too high, so then I made this one. So what I actually do is I put this little rod goes through here. I'll show you, goes, this little rod goes through here. I'll show you what is what everything is made out of through there. I put pieces of straw here so the gimbal don't do this while it's flying. And then I just, you know, I slip it in here. I slip it in the hole and the gimbal hangs down here. I put a little bit of extension on the legs and it stands up. So it actually it looks like this. But let me show you the basic idea of how I made this. First, let me take the camera out. This is my ELE. Uh, 4k camera 50 bucks really nice works really good I guarantee you guys it works good uh, I take out this rod I'm gonna tear it apart because I can put it back together this is a part of where the camera came this is what holds the camera I don't use this clip I this clip is for the hat uh, this is where I fit the camera and this actually is uh, another part of the camera. Let me take it apart. So this is the gimbal, really. See? Then with the straw there, what it does this, with a piece of cable there, what it does is this, up and down. And here, it goes this way, sideways. So it's actually a two-axis gimbal. Don't know if you guys can see me too good. Okay, I'm going to take it apart and show you guys how I made this and how simple it is. Okay? Down here, where this little screw goes, I just stuck this in there and I glued this thing down. Let me take it out. Now, you see what this is? Really, don't forget how it used to look. This is where the camera goes, here, and this is how the gimbal goes. So this is actually a part that, of the camera. This is just glue, okay? This here is this little piece of a T. Go, used to go there. I cut that there, cut it on an angle, and I then I let me take it apart. Okay, this is a bottle cap. This is the little engine from a CD rum where the CD lays when you open the tray. I took the little engine out, I took the little engine out, and I cut this here, I sand this a little bit which is this here and I stuck the engine in there and glued it together I can take this out there you go you see and this is actually that's all this is the little engine I painted this stuff black this is the little engine so the bottle cap will go on this side after it actually goes like this the CD lays on here boom it has a little so I took the thing where the CD lays on that spins around so the lens could read it I took that off. This doesn't do anything. This goes into here in the back, stuck in there really glued well, and the bottle cap goes. I cut the top of the bottle cap so it doesn't uh, crash with the drone. And then this goes in here really tight. And you have this. And then that's what does this movement. Once you put the rest of the engine in there, then you have this movement with two little holes. I, I uh, did with a hot, with the same rod. I heated it up and I made this two little holes here. And that's what gives it this movement. 
and this gives it this movement. So you actually have a two axis gimbal. See, so you have the engine, you have a piece of uh, this goes here. It's all glued together, man. I'm, I'm a little ashamed of showing this is garbage, but it works. It works pretty good. If you watch the CD where it says second part, uh, ELE versus uh, drone camera, you'll see. So actually this used to go here, like this. Okay, I just cut it off, made a slot there so that I can fit this part that goes here, which is what holds this so you can put the camera in and then the little engine goes one side to the battle cop and the other one in here and that's what the gimbal is all about see i tightened this i glued it so it doesn't do this you know so actually you have this that turns sideways and when you fit this in here when you fit the, the little rod in there then you have this movement so you have the movement, you have the movement like this, and you have the movement like this for the yaw. So when you do a yaw, what it does is, you know, it stays straight. And when you go, when you go forward, when you do a forward pitch, it keeps the camera in shape. It keeps the camera still. And so actually all you need is a piece of a T, of a T from a PVC uh, T. This one of these. Uh, if you have a old, if you have camera, you're not using the parts. You could always use it. You see, they don't, they don't get damaged. See, uh, one one of these, which goes in here. I actually put a little rubber in there so that when I tighten it, the front stays to the front. See, one of these. Then you slide the camera into the little hole you made in the PVC. The little you you eat out with uh with anything. It doesn't have to be a little saw, a little. You know something to cut and you got it in then there you go you got your gimbal this way goes this way you know and this way it goes this way so actually you have your gimbal there it's really simple to make and if you look at the videos you'll see i made a a comparison the same video i, I recorded with the top with the with the drone camera and then i recorded with this camera at the same time so they're the exact videos the only difference is one was recorded with the camera the other one was recorded with the 1080p a drone camera so they actually was just like this so everything i did everything i did was being recorded at the same time and you guys could look at the footage and i wish really i'm going to be honest with you that you guys could modify this make it a little better than i could make it i don't have no resources i don't have anything to work on i, I live out in the country in the dominican republic but i do have a lot of ideas and I try to transmit them to you guys so you guys see what you can do. And it makes me really happy when I see that you guys, you know, you know, comment. Let me know if, if you made a better one, if you like the idea. I hope you do. I'm going to always be here for you guys. It's simple. Remember, if you have any doubts, just go back on the video a little bit to the part where you don't understand. My English is not perfect, but I do know how to say I love you guys. God bless you. Have a beautiful week, you know, and share uh, my videos, subscribe, give me a like. It really helps me, you know. It makes me happy when I see, like, I got 127 subscribers. I wish I had 500, 600. That way I know I'm helping a lot of people, man. It's not about the money, you know. <laughs> you don't make money on YouTube unless you're a big shot. But anyway, guys, have a nice week. I love you. I hope this was helpful. God bless you, okay? Peace.